Hello everybody, welcome back to the 100 Baby Challenge. First of all, I, w I just washed my hair. And the last time I got on YouTube with wet hair, someone told me I needed to wash my hair because I looked greasy. I treated it! I'm just gonna put it out there right now. I just like my hair! My hair is so heavily bleached, it doesn't get greasy, so whatever. Anyway, I'm still kind of working out the kinks with the screen recording stuff. And last time, like, I didn't record the game audio, I guess, so sorry. <sighs> but I think I have it figured out this time. Hopefully, I don't know. But we're going to return to the LaFart household, of course. I did do a little bit more remodeling. Still not as much as I wanted to. But some nonetheless, I'll show you. I'll give you a little quick tour. Tour. All right, what's up LaFart household? So I redid the kitchen. We got all fresh black appliances. Got some cute cabinets that literally do nothing, but I mean, they're aesthetically pleasing. Got some of these little trees with, I don't know, are those feathers? Who cares? Doesn't matter. My fridge looks like a vending machine. And then when you go into the living room, there's a nice tray of scrambled eggs with bacon on the floor. But uh, basically all that's changed is, well, I wanted to like buy a TV, buy a new stereo, buy a new computer, but guess who made out of money? <laughs> I put a couch there, painted the walls, and that's it. Do I just have a new baby? Okay, I must have just had a new baby, and that said baby is sleeping, which means we gotta get knocked up again. No time to waste. Who is next? Eric Lewis, duh. <laughs> Eric. I don't know if I edited this out last time or not, but um, he's married, so I think that's why it's been so difficult to seduce him. I think Andrea just likes a challenge. Come on, come on. Um, hello. He's material. Oh, yeah. Realistic. Great. Maybe that's why he doesn't like me because I have nothing in my living room but spoiled sure. eggs. Yay, boy! And he's pissed. Is someone calling my baby? Oh, shit. Oh, sweet baby. Your daddy passed away. That's kind of sad, but we got right in there right on time. <laughs> a good friend. Yeah, okay. Let's call him that. <laughs> Let's try to call him over again. There he is, jogging like a hero. There's the Trifer baby. Let's go. It's almost Calvin's birthday too? Oh! We're gonna have like multiple birthday parties this episode, I think. Yay! Alright, Eric. You can go. Oh shit, T today is Michaela's birthday. I guess I should like throw her a party today before she turns into a little wuss. Like, we forgot her birthday last time, so. <laughs> we gotta throw a birthday party before Michaela. What? What? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? The baby needs a diaper change. What's the problem here? Why is everyone so difficult? Is everyone just staring at my crying baby when I need to be changing the freaking diaper? I'm about to start kicking people out of this fucking house. Why can't I change this diaper? Because this guy's in the way. Would everyone just get out of the way? Leave my baby alone. How about that? Oh my god. Move, sir. Move. Move! God. Finally! Now that the party is almost halfway over, why is Michaela embarrassed? She had a bad day at school, well it's her birthday, so why don't you go blow out the candles? Freaking finally. Okay. She wants knowledge. She wants to be a computer whiz. She wants to know everything about computers. And we get to pick one more trait for her, I believe there were 25? Alright. Okay, Michaela's final traits are, she's a quick learner, she's hot-headed, and she's also <laughs> Active. She's active, but also wants to know about computers. Okay. Wow. Well, didn't she make a bit of a transformation? Look at this starry-eyed bitch. <laughs> we got a bronze medal. And I think the rule is once they're like a young adult, then you can move them out of the household. Now, tomorrow is Calvin's birthday, so we're going to have two teenagers. Kelsey is tense because she- oh, there's a lot of strangers in the house and it's freaking her out. Oh, she can change his diaper. Oh, that's great. We have more help in the family. That's great. That makes things a lot easier, I think. Oh, look at who it is. He's looking pretty sad these days. Hello there. Were you just sleeping in her bed? One thing I want to do when we have more money is I want to build like a little loft area for all the teenagers to sleep in. Because like this is a kid's room, right? But like the teenagers need a place to like eat salads and drink some tea. Okay, we got a haunted MF and toilet up in here. And he broke my toilet. I just gave you a bath, child. Are you serious? Like, are you joking? Calvin, don't even think about it. Are you serious? Is that your camera? Mm-hmm. 
enough of this freaking baby. I'm ready for her to be aged up. Celebrate Dax's birthday. It's Raquel's birthday too. We got a lot of aging up to do right now. For Raquel's first trait, Raquel is inquisitive. That's not bad. Why is Raquel sad? Oh, because her daddy died. <laughs> This episode is such a bummer. So sad. She's gonna be sad for two days. Do you see what you've done to this family, Jeffrey? I hope Dax doesn't lose his cute hair. So Dax is a whiz kid. He wants to be the smartest kid in school. That's good. And then out of all these traits, he is also gloomy. Oh, he's a gloomy little smart kid. Dax, what happened to your cute hair? I only liked him for his hair. And what is that sweater vest? Are you kidding me? We got a silver medal. All right, kids, fun's over. Time to do your homework. I'm just now realizing I have like a little stream in my backyard. How come I never do anything with this? What's this? I could go fishing? How cute! I picked a really cute little lot. I didn't even know. I'm really desperately wanting a baby that doesn't have the same color hair. Like we all have the same color hair. I wonder if I can write like a sad book. Oh yeah, I can! Let's write some sad stuff, cause we're so sad. I'm just gonna call this book, Jeffrey Died and I'm Sad. That's a number one bestseller. Yo, Michaela, can you like get some food for this baby? You're gonna learn to cook today, Michaela. Are you taking a selfie while you're making grilled cheese? Can she like go jogging in the middle of the night? Yeah, go jogging, Michaela. I don't know. You like to be active, right? So, bye. I really do feel bad for Raquel. It's my fault for desperately wanting to get some Jeffrey loving, and I left her with a dead dad. That is so sad. Toddler pajamas in this game really are adorable. Oh, she's sleeping. Oh, my heart. Milton. Alright. Is Michaela still jogging? She's still angry. That hasn't changed. She did just jog a lot too. You'd think that would help her blow off some steam, but I guess not. We need some romance music. Oh, he's materialistic too. That's okay. I've been known to know a few materialistic boys in my day. Are we dancing and talking at the same time? I guess so. Cute. So he should be an easy one to land. Be about to have a baby real soon. Oh, also, isn't it Calvin's birthday? Oh my god, it is Calvin's birthday. Okay, maybe we should make a cake. Dang, I almost missed it. Ooh, I almost forgot. Ooh, a hamburger cake? Don't mind if I do, Calvin. You want a fucking hamburger cake? Michaela, can you come clean up this cake? Come one, come all, baby daddy. I keep thinking there's a baby over there that I forget about, and there's not. <laughs> Congratulations, Calvin. Aspirations for Calvin. How many are there? Him and Michaela have the same family of aspirations. They both are gonna be, like, smarty pants, but Calvin is, he's got a nerd brain. He wants to be both book smart and handy. He's a quick learner. He is cheerful, and he is also a foodie. Cool. Well, hello, Calvin. Suave as ever. Except those pants. What are those pants? Bitch, what the fuck? She's playing in trash instead of going into labor. Do you want to go into labor? Come on, just squirt it out. Finally! Let's have a baby out of the hospital this time. We got two teenagers. They can look after the kids. We're going to the hospital. We're gonna walk to the hospital. We got a boy, and his name is Bradley. <laughs> Hello, Bradley LaFart. Oh, oh, God. Oh. Calvin, who said you could sleep in my bed? All right. Well, we finally got to the place we need to be. So I'm gonna save here. And this episode here, we had like, what, three birthday parties? I think we have another one. Nayeli's gonna have a birthday party next episode. We got a brand new baby. Look at him, little tiny guy. Also, since we got money again, I'm gonna go ahead and build a sweet hangout spot. Also, I guess I should finish the living room too, but also, I'll swing a hangout spot. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you whenever I see you.